Hello, I'm Anthony Hughes, and I'm here to tell you about the improvements we've made to frame and system brakes in Dorico 4. Firstly, we've made it easy to move bars to the previous or next system to assist with manual casting off. In engrave mode, make a selection at any point in a bar and use the key command comma to move that bar to the previous system. Use period to move the bar to the next system. If the selection is in the middle of a system, then all bars up until that point will move to the previous or next system. Dorico creates the necessary system breaks with the required properties to make this work. It can make it so much easier to achieve your desired layout. Now, while you can still make a system or frame break at any point in the music, the most usual requirement is to have them at bar lines. As a result, we've now made that the default, and regardless of what item you select, the beginning of that bar will be used as the position for creating the break. The same principle applies to the make into system and make into frame commands, all of which makes it much quicker and reliable to perform your own casting off. If you do want to create system and frame breaks in the middle of bars, that's fine by me, Open the note input and editing page of preferences and uncheck the option to snap breaks to bar lines. We've also added quick and handy buttons firstly to lock an entire layout, which creates frame and system breaks on every page, and also to reset a layout, which removes all existing frame and system breaks from every page. If you've enjoyed this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up to let me know and subscribe to the Dorico channel right now to see much more like this. I'm Anthony Hughes. Thanks for watching.